We're back. We're back. We're back. I want to talk about animals. <laughs> yeah. No, I was going to talk about, like, like hive minds. Those like things animals are... that all work together? Yeah, like bees and ants and termites. Like, those things, like, yeah. it's, it's nuts. Have you seen that uh, disease that, like, ants can get in the Amazon where it pretty much turns them into a zombie? And, like, the other ants will throw them out of the colony because they're like, bitch, you're infected. Is it in, like, a, a fungus or something? Yeah, the ants end up, like, climbing up to a really high point, And then the fungus grows out of the top of their head and, like, explodes so that it spreads out more because it's at a high point. That's scary. Imagine that in humans. <laughs> Yo. I love that you're just playing catch. Uh. See, this boss is always annoying. He's cute! It's a little doggo! It is really cute, but... You like throwing balls at animals, I get it. But like, you can't hurt it with your sword or anything, so like, it's just always... <sighs> just die! <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Yeah, I saw a video recently too of dolphins getting high off a of puffer fish. Yeah, is that real? Yeah. Or is that like stoner like, propaganda? I'm pretty sure it's real because like they grabbed the puffer fish and they were like passing it back and forth and stuff like that. And maybe their intention isn't to get high when they're playing with it. Maybe they're just like, oh, it's a fucking ball, but. Then they get stoned ass, so... Yeah, but they, they like, fucking, so they must, like, get an eye. Yeah. They, like, fucking, they like getting high. <laughs> Yo, dolphins, fuck, man. Dolphins, like, rape humans. Yeah. Uh, I... When I went up to Florida, like, a few years ago, my cousin really wanted us to, like, swim with the dolphins and shit, and I was like, I do not want to do that at all. <laughs> but we went and we fed them. Okay. Yeah, I I, I I would do that, but dude, I like I used to be really afraid of like water animals cuz they're just, they're fucked up. They are. And they are. That's a they, perfectly rational fear. They Ra told us rational? Rational. Yeah. Rational. I have a rash. <laughs> They, they told us before we went in there, like, you can't have anything hanging on you because the dolphins will grab it and drag you under. And I had, like, a, a poncho on because it was raining and I was there and I was, like, leaning over and, like, feeding it. And they're like, you can't wear the poncho while you're feeding them because it's too loose and they'll grab it. And I'm like, what the fuck? Murder dolphins! Like... What did you just do? You just... Oh, I want to get back to the beginning. I'm pretty sure I just go here now. Okay. But yeah, if you ever get an opportunity to, f to feed a dolphin, when they open their mouths, it's fucking terrifying because it's just like rows of teeth. Yeah. <laughs> like murder teeth. <laughs> it's like if no, like I I think like. You just went in a circle. Are they? trying to kill you when they're pulling you under or are they just trying to be like buds i uh, they're both <laughs> i'm yeah. sure some of them are just like trying to play and i'm sure like okay if they're like sexual they're definitely probably have evil intentions too yeah i feel like like uh well I feel. Uh, I know the, there's two animals that people cry over. Well, I guess three now. Dogs, horses, and dolphins. Horses. Ugh. Remember horse, horse girls in our high school? Yes. Horse girls are fucking weird people, man. They love their horses. I remember, like, just, like, these girls would, like, draw pictures of horses all the time and talk about riding all the time and just... Yeah. Everything, everything they ever did was about horses. So weird. And we didn't even have, like, My Little Pony and shit then, so literally it was just, like... 
That was... It, it was just like their family was rich enough to own a horse. So. Yeah, there was actually one of them when we were in high school. Uh, one of the horse girls was in my class, and she was actually bitching about, well, why don't we have an equestrian team? Like, uh, because we would have to build a stable, uh, we would have to buy horses, we would have to hire somebody to care for those horses. And like, like it's, it, it's are you insane? so expensive to like, like keep a horse. Yeah, that, that that's somebody who's like clearly like money was never an issue in yeah. growing up because it's just like I I don't get it like just have it like what yeah exactly and the thing is too is like our school was poor we didn't even have like a freaking football team remember they they so our our high school was relatively new when we went to it and. God damn it. They didn't they, even build it big enough? <laughs> yeah, it wasn't, like, big enough. So, like, they had to, like, redo it. Yeah, I remember, like, they put in portables to, like, try and be like, Oh, here we go! Like, here, students, the portables were not air-conditioned or anything like that. So in the summer... Oh, they got like, dang. Not summer, summer, but, like, spring. Like, fucking a bunch of teenagers, are you kidding me? You know how bad those fucking things smelt? I remember them being <laughs> hot, and I remember being like, Oh, I got math. Better go get my winter coat. I know! And, like, the thing was, oh my god, having math class in there, and, like, the floors were so fucking uneven and shit, and it's just like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm gonna fail this class now because, like, I, one, can't see the fucking chalkboard, and two, like, I, if I put my pencil down on my desk, it's gonna fucking roll. Yeah, man. I remember like, being so hot and so cold and those stupid, stupid fucking portables. And they had random poles in the middle of the class, which, I mean, okay, obviously they're there so that, like, the fucking roof doesn't cave in on you, but, like, when I was for like in my second uh, math class that I had, the first place they ever sat me down was like right behind that pole, and I'm like, I can't fucking see. Like, <laughs> <laughs> are you kidding me? Oh yeah, the structural poles. <laughs> oh my god. So yep. I like complained to the teacher, and they're like, you can see around it, and I'm like, I, no, I can't. I, 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 I can't. I promise you. <laughs> I don't want to be leaning over to my right, like, this entire semester. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, our school yeah. is pretty jank. Oh, I miss my chance. Such garbage. Uh, oh well, never have to go back uh, again. Nice! Okay, wait, I need to go back and do that, though. There's a chest I was supposed to hook shot to. Would you go... Okay, would you go back to high school as you right now? So, like, if you were... Your brain in your, like, 16-year-old body, would you I mean, go back and relive high school? I wouldn't relive high school to relive high school. I'd relive high school to give myself an advantage in life. Okay. Like, I wouldn't go back to be like, oh, remember all these beautiful times with all these people, blah, blah, blah. Like, I would go back and be like, hey, your brain works. Go and do homework and get all A's and now go to fucking school and yeah. have, like, scholarships. Yeah, that would have been nice. But you wouldn't want to like relive the glory days or like no. Oh, not you're at all. You, you're smarter now, so you could have like better times dating and stuff. I don't give a shit. I don't want to date no garbage people from there. Anyways. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, this boss sucks. So you I have didn't to really date anybody from our high school, anyways. I guess that's true. What do you have to do right now? I have to beat these guys from up here. Because that's the only way you can get to the, the chest. It's fine, just get them to swallow. Wow, they're just staying in the corners. 
God's <laughs> sake. Okay, there's one. <laughs> and then it doesn't go like the entire way. Oh. We're gonna be here for a while, folks. So like, what happens if you just stand right close to the edge? Uh, you don't want to break? What? Wait, how did that go that way? Okay, I won't fight it. Don't fight it, man. What? Okay. There you go. Nope. Dang it. There you go. Yes, see? Nice. Got herself a small key. For a small door. Just want to check. Okay, so now we have to go back here and get this door open. Nice, nice. Snake. Do you believe in like the Chinese zodiacs and shit like that? No. And the other zodiacs? Not really. Do you? No, I don't believe in horoscopes at all. People that are like, oh, my horoscope today says like blah blah blah. I'm just like, okay. Yeah, like. Pretty, pretty sure, like. The moon and stars don't have an influence over your life in your daily procedures, but if it's, you want to pretend. It's just all, like, super, like, generic, like, statements and stuff. Something or, like, or, may or may not happen to you that you may or may not find favorable today. Or it's like, it's like, Lucky oh, like, number seven. Libra, it's like, you want more money, and it's like, yeah, how'd you know? <laughs> Wow! Oh, he's gonna box you. I worked with a girl and she like was really into horoscopes and stuff like that. Yeah. But like with the Chinese zodiac, she like explained too that depending on what time you were born and what year you were actually born, dictated different personality traits and she swore like for her kids it matched up. And like for me, she's like, oh no, that makes sense for you. And I'm like, okay. Like, are you sure you're just not reading more into it than what it actually is? Right. Because, like, her one son was a rat, and because he was born at nighttime, she said that's why he was, like, he had a lot of energy and stuff like that, and why he was mischievous and stuff like that, and I'm like, are you sure just not him? Like... <sighs> He's just not a <laughs> child. Okay, so this, yeah. is the, this is the thing in the, this game that really... That door right there... Because this is the only switch in this entire dungeon. And for some reason, you're supposed to just... No? I'm sorry. <laughs> About the emergencies. Yeah, what's going on in your street? Yeah, I don't know. There's always something. So we... I Finally, I figured this out. So let me go here. And then this is the last item, right? Yes. The magic ro rod. The magic rod. It's a pretty cool item. It I don't kinda, remember that in any of the other games. It kind of sucks that it's like the last thing you get. And like I already have like two items more powerful than it, but you know, what can you do? <laughs> So the magic rod does Tell me about it. it Tell me. This. Is that ice? Yeah, it shoots fire. Oh, okay. Burr. See, look, it's so much fun. Oh, I don't have a key. <laughs> Shit. What do I get? What do I, where do I get a key from? 
Not there. Not there. Oh, I know where. Where's that? Where's that dark room? This way? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Anita, <laughs> I got this. I remember. I, I thought remember. you already got the key in that room. No, there's this dark room down here. Oh. That we couldn't light these before. And this is a key? Yes. There you is. go. Now you just have to walk all the way around again. Right. How. Uh, where was I? Oh, that looks fun. Well, the fire rod apparently two shots this guy, too. So. I guess maybe it is pretty strong. So let me go here. I like that it looks like a shitty match. <laughs> it looks like a lollipop. <laughs> like with its wrapper on still or something. Yep. Thanks for the candy, mister. What's your favorite candy? Oh, candy. Um, I don't know. Uh, I mean, it's not really candy, but like, I like yogurt covered cranberries. Yeah, that's not candy at all. Okay. I don't know. Because, like, the real candy candy, I don't really like. So, what's your favorite chocolate bar? I like Eat More's. I yeah, like Big yeah. Turks. Oh! <laughs> I know. Oh, oh why? <laughs> they just taste good, man. No, they don't. <laughs> uh, Eat More's, Big Turks, and... Um... Mostly those two, I guess. Huh. I know. They're not even, like, the popular ones. I don't like Twix, but, like... Twix is okay sometimes. Yeah. I used to hate Twix, and then one time I had one, and I was like, this is so good. And then I overate Twix, and I was like, eh, ah, they're really not that great. They're bad again, guys. <laughs> yeah. I think... Yeah. Oh my god. I think peanut butter cups are overrated. Oh, no, I love Reese's peanut butter cups. I'd rather Reese's Pieces or, um, uh, what is it? Butterfinger? Are you Butterfinger so nasty. So good! No, I had one once and I was like, never again. Oh, you know what I like? Uh, curly Whirlies, I think they're called. It's curling a... Curling Whirlies. Yeah, it's a, um... Like a UK chocolate bar made by Willy Wonka. Okay. They have, like, toffee in the middle. And it's just, like, chocolate on toffee. And it sticks to your teeth. Oh. It's great. No, oh, thank you. Uh, M&M's or, or, uh, Smarties? M&M's. Yes. Well... Yeah, M&M's. You know, yeah. anybody that's, like, American watching this, when we say Smarties, is thinking of rockets? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why they call rockets Smarties. It's really weird. It's just, yeah. So did, I guess they don't have Smarties there then. Yeah, Smarties is a Canadian thing. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know what chocolate bar I forgot existed? <laughs> Until I saw it at the store again? What? Crunch bars. Oh, those are so good. They are so terrible. Whoa. Do you like Arrow? No. Why not? No. Why? Why not? Because it's just, it's so plain and boring. So you'd much rather eat, like, chocolate with terrible jam in it? 
It's not jam, it's jelly. <laughs> <laughs> it's like jube jube candies. Okay, so That's now like... I'm lost because I don't know how to get to the nightmare door. Nightmare, nightmare! Weren't you already there? You have to like come up from a ladder. Right, you have to come up from. Oh, you gotta. Okay, so you need to go up a floor. Try that door. Cross this bridge. Yes, boss. Go down there. <laughs> this is the wrong place. This is the wrong place. Unless, wait, go back the other way. Yep. Yep. Is this the thing? Do you have to go up there? Well, we'll figure it out next time. I'll, I'll read a walkthrough real quick. I bet you go up that thing. Goodbye! Bye!